Ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy, Mr. Headquarters. Check it out. We had a community live update from Sledgehammer. It was not what I was looking for, if you could not tell by the thumbnail. I was here at one o'clock, my time, waiting on this to go live, just so I could check out, finally, the fix with the Calvary Division. Little did I know, these happy little guys sitting down below me, just struck my dreams to pieces. I mean, that's the reason why everybody's going to Fortnite right now because Sledgehammer is not with the community. They are killing the game. And I guarantee you when Black Ops 4 comes out that you're gonna have a very, very hard time finding you a lobby due to the fact of Sledgehammer is ruining the game. I mean, Calvary Division just killed it for me. I mean, I cannot hardly grind it because Every time I try to get into a fight, you have that one person on that team in the Calvary Division squatted down, just distracting you and just, you know, walking towards you. And then as soon as you try to turn around and run, he pulls out his pistol or his shotgun or whatever and shoots you. Or you're sitting there trying to, you know, play chicken with him, just, you know, try to get the kill. Then you wind up getting killed from a teammate from behind him or beside him or whatever just come out of nowhere and shoot you i mean it, it just gets so annoying that i don't even feel like playing the game hardly anymore i mean I, I i don't even think i'm gonna try to grind a contract just so i can see sledgehammer fail on the contract side because i mean i had my boy yankee open up over 200 supply drops and i got none of the guns i was looking for yeah i got 10 dlc weapons some of which i've already had you know they was not really duplicates but they was other ones you know variants but i mean come on sledgehammer man work with the community here i mean fix it i mean we was really hoping for it to be something where we could shoot through the shield or you know somehow or another to break the shield or something to counter it and little did i know all you did was go over exclusive aces tutorial on his youtube video on how to counter the cavalry division if you do not know one is throw a sticky Two, get the Molotov, throw it. Three, go from the left side instead of the right side because you're more prone to get them. And then also shoot at the feet. I mean, is that the real big hype that y'all come across? And then you're going to say that, okay, the Calvary Division is right where we want it to be. It's only used by a certain percentage. It's not overpowered. There's not too many people using it. So therefore, it's right where we want it to be. Here's how to counter it. Man, baloney, go on with that mess. I mean, really. I mean, really. You're killing it. The only thing good that I've seen come out of this video that I sat here and wasted 30 minutes of my time on was that the Nambo Type 2 is going to be in one of the orders come up in the next week or the next update. And which I already have that gun, so I mean, it's really no hype for me. But if you have not already grinded out for that, that is something for you to look forward to to get on and try to complete that contract or order, whatever it may fall in. And then also, here we go again, Sledgehammer. It's in the middle of July, and you just now even halfway resemble the Master Prestige reward. I mean, and you didn't even announce it in that. Oh, it's in the files. We're working on it. You can't crack the files and tell what it is. I mean, really. <laughs> really? Sledgehammer, I just want to tell you face to face, your game is garbage. I mean, I only play it because it's the newest Call of Duty, and just like Infinite Warfare, as soon as Black Ops 4 comes out, I guarantee you, you will not see Mr. Headquarters back in a lobby. I don't care what you update the game to, I'm not going to play it no more. The only reason why I'm playing it little by little, and after a couple of games I get bored with it, I mean, there's nothing to grind for. I mean, give us something, give us some heroic unlock tokens, give us some tokens to unlock our variant we want. I mean, give the Master Prestigers a reward and quit stalling till, I mean, we ain't got but two more months left of the game and y'all have, I mean, the game is gonna be over in October. I mean, I'm sorry to tell you, Sledgehammer, you might as well pack your bags and go to the house because it's not gonna happen, okay? Your game is over. You should have fixed all this stuff a long time ago. I mean, go on YouTube and look at all the YouTubers that y'all see making videos on your stuff. All they're doing now is Fortnite. 
because Fortnite is updating the community and keeping it grinding, keeping something hype going, you know, and you failed to do that, Sledgehammer, World well, War II, I'm sorry to tell you, but, I mean, that's all I got to say on that. So for the other half of that <laughs> thumbnail that you saw, let's go ahead and jump right on in. Black Ops 4, baby. Yes, the hype is back. If you have been living under a rock, I'll say it again, if you've been living under a rock, you did not know that today they launched out the beta dates for PS4, Xbox, and PC, okay? So, I mean, the hype is real. Come August, the 1st of August, August 3rd, they're gonna drop that. So, your boy better best believe he's gonna be on here grinding and streaming. So make sure that you hit that like button and smash that subscribe button and stay tuned so whenever I go live, you can be the first one to know and stay tuned with me, okay? Now with that, once this video hits 200 likes, I will be giving away two beta codes to two lucky subscribers on my account. So go ahead right now, enter in. All you gotta do is hit that like button and smash that subscribe button and I will pick two of you once this hits 200, I will email you or whatever, get in touch with you on YouTube and send you the code, okay? So let's go ahead and jump on and show these dates here. We got the PlayStation 4 starts August 3rd at 10 a.m. Pacific time and ends at August 6th, okay? And then the PlayStation 4 and Xbox One starts on August the 10th and ends on August the 13th. Blah, August the 13th, okay? The PC Beta Early Access is going to start on August the 10th at 10 a.m. Pacific Time on exclusive on Battle.net. So go ahead and get on there and get that all set up. And then the PC Open Beta starts on August the 11th at 10 a.m. Pacific Time and ends on August 13th. Okay? But that right there is going to wrap it up, man. Your boy is so hyped for Black Ops 4, I can't even explain. You know, and I hope that everybody takes their sledgehammer game, crushes it up, throw in a nice little pretty envelope, stamp that mail stamp on it, and send it back to them and say, your game is trash, have it back, I'm not playing it no more. I mean, if we can get some hype doing that, I guarantee you I'll make a video on it and send mine along with it because obviously I'm tired of World War II. I mean, the game is done. You've been knowing since December when your game fell off. It was the earliest game to ever fall off at Call of Duty. I mean, it's hated. So, Treyarch, if you're watching this, I hope that you do not fall in the lines of Sledgehammer. I hope that you really strive for something to grind for. Give us something to keep coming back and keep grinding in the game and make it last till the next one comes out. Hopefully, it's uh, Modern Warfare. You know, we'll see. Who knows? But, hey. I'm going to get out of y'all's hair. Y'all have a fantastic day. Don't forget to hit that like button and smash that subscribe button. And stay tuned to your boy, Mr. Headquarters. And once we reach them 200 likes, I'll be giving out those two exclusive beta codes for Black Ops 4. So once we hit that before August, I'll go ahead and get those out to those people and make a video and congratulate them on winning. But hey, I got to get out of here. I hope y'all have a fantastic day. Peace.